currently sitting right behind you. Say hi, Mom. Hello. And so we're going to be doing the Do I Have This Book or That Book Challenge. I got a request from this person right here, and they wanted me to do this challenge. So if you guys request any video ideas, there's a very high chance that I will do them. Somebody requested the bookshelf tour. I hated that video, but I still did it because you requested it. So here I am with this challenge. So, Mom, you have a timer going on your phone? Oh, no. Yeah. So basically, my there was... The creator of this challenge, which will be linked in the description box, did this challenge in eight minutes. So my goal is to try and do it in eight minutes or under. Um, and my mom's going to read the questions, and then I'm going to show the book to you guys, and she's going to continue on with the next question. So, as soon as you're ready, Mom, are you... Um, there's 20 questions here. Yes, I know. And I try to read it in eight, eight minutes. I'm not Woo! sure I can even read them in eight minutes. That's not funny. You're going to have to, because you're on my team, Mom. Question number one. Okay. How do I start this timer? Okay. Just hit right here. Um, this is a timer, so you put it in and you want to start a stopwatch. All right. Whoop. So then you just click OK. All right. Question number one. Do you have a book with deckled edges? Yes. My Plain Jane by the Lady Janes. Next. Do you have a book with three or more people on the cover? Oh, no. Tick tock, tick tock. That's not how <laughs> Three or more people on the cover. I don't think I have one with three or more people. Just go. Number three, do you have a book based on another fictional story? Uh, probably. Um, um too much oh, pressure here we go, here we go. Okay. Always never yours, based on Shakespeare. Go. Do you have a book with a title of ten letters long? You're burning up time, babe. Eight, nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Go to the top eight, shelf. Can I help or am I supposed to second? I don't letters? know. I don't know. Ten letters? Ten letters? Ten letters long. Oh, one, two, I see a big long word on the very top shelf. Um uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I don't know, skip it. We wasted a lot of time on that one. Do you have a book with a title that starts and ends with the same letter? K S T E uh, S T E N. Oh my god. Starts and ends with the same letter. Oh my god, I don't know if I, I probably do, I just can't see because it's so much pressure. Why do these all start with that? <sighs> I don't know. We're going to skip another one. I'm not very good at this. We are not doing very well. <laughs> Um, do you have a mass market paperback book? I have two! Boom! Do you have a book written by an author using a pen name? Yes! Oh my god, I do! Victoria Schwab! Do you have a book with the character's name in the title? Um, um, well, does this one count? Because Jack the River is the main villain. Yep. Do you have a book with two maps in it? Two maps? No, I don't think I do. I don't even need to waste time on that one. Do you have a book that was turned into a TV show? Um. Yeah. I have well, some movie. based on movies, yeah, but I don't have any on TV shows. What about the one that we're waiting to come out on Netflix? Is that a movie or a... The Witcher! Oh, I do! Oh! Do you have a book written by someone who is originally famous for something else. Oh yeah, that's my section Jeez. there. <laughs> um, do you have a book with a clock on the cover? Um, no. Do you have a poetry book? Oh uh, no, no. Don't do you have a book with an award stamp on it? Uh, yes, I bet I do. Do you have a graphic novel? No, I don't buy those. Do you have a book written by two or more authors? Zenith knew you would come in handy somehow. Do you have a book that was turned into a movie? Yep. This one's got to be turned into a movie. Well, this one is everything, a movie. Everything was a terrible movie. Yeah. I had to set through. 
Well, that's why it's something that I don't like you show. Do you have a book that is between 500 and 510 pages long? Oh, no. Yeah, it. Where's that book? It. That is not between 500. Oh. That's a thousand pages. Oh. 500 and 510. This is not it. Um. We need more books, apparently. you're reading from Keeper of the Lost City. Those aren't between 500 and 510 pages. They're either under 500 or they're over 510. Go! Uh, do you have a book of short stories? Boom! Throughout the dark. Do you have a book written by an author with the same initials as you? MP? You got plenty of time here and that's your last question. So go MP. down through all of them looking for someone with the same initials as you. I don't even think I have any on here with M. I'm not gonna lie to you. Um, How about the clock on the cover? We never did find a clock on the cover. I don't have any books with clocks on the cover. I don't think I have any with, uh, I just skip these shelves. Uh, no, I don't think I have that either. So that's the end of it. That's all the questions, but you haven't gotten them. You haven't answered all of them. Now, how long did it take me to do it? Uh, we're at five minutes. <gasps> Whoa! Well, I didn't get all the but questions. But you didn't really do all of them, babe. I know. Like, I think you could probably find something, a uh, book with the title ten letters long. Probably. Ten letters. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five, six. What about a book with two maps in it? What about that one hardcover there I just bought you that you opened up and had a map inside it? This, is this isn't a hardcover. No, the Keeper of the Lost, the, the last series I just bought for you. That one doesn't have a map in it. I thought there was a picture of a pond or something. This? That's yeah. not a map. That's just a Keepy and uh, Fit scene that I oh. love so much. Huh. Well, I didn't succeed, but I beat her time. I don't think. I don't think that counts. Time, if we but didn't answer it. all of them. I mean, we could have gone really fast if I just read them and you said no, skip it. We could have been done in like forty-five seconds. I think we need some more books. Well, you were just saying really all you want for your birthday is books. Now, this seems so ridiculous, does it, Mom? Mm, yeah, it does. All right. Well, let's see how many I got correct. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Take off one of those because I got two books for the same question. I got eleven of them. Woo! Out of 20, not bad, not bad. What's that great percent? Boom, it's right there on the screen. <laughs> anyway, thank you guys so much for watching the video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Again, if you have any other video requests you'd like me to do, tell me in the comment section. And I'll see you guys all next Monday for another video. Slow down. They're, they have to rewind this and listen to it three times. Well, they didn't need to rewind the outro. Anyway, guys, I'll see you guys in the next video next Monday. Hey, don't forget, I'm still a freaky bulldozer. Bye, guys.